So, why would you wear crystals and why do I? Well, there's many different reasons and many different beliefs, but what's common amongst all of them is that they help realign your internal persona, your personality, into different areas. So let's say I want to focus more when I'm studying. I might wear a certain crystal, or if I want to like be more calm, I'll wear another one. And there's other ones that I like give you more energy, clear the blood, attract certain types of people, etc. So there's many different reasons and there's hundreds of crystals. I have a crystal book at home, so I've researched quite a bit and I've taken two crystal tests online and these kind of narrowed down on what I should use and what I need right now. So yeah, that's it. I'll show you how to cleanse them properly when I'm back in the hotel room. But it's really simple and it's important to cleanse them. There are many ways through which you can clear a crystal. Any of the top methods do work and are great, I'd stick with them. But I'm going to share two in this video that I often use and they're probably my favorite. So, method number one is the sage method. You get a piece of sage, like normally a few leaves bundled up with some string. You light it on fire and then you cover the crystal with the smoke and just do it a few times maybe like 10 seconds overall and when it's covered in smoke you just leave it it's perfect it's cleared this is a very good and quick method but it does mean you have to have a lighter and some sage however I don't have that right now so this method that I'm going to show you personally is my other favorite method you grab the crystal with as little of your skin touching the surface and put it under a tap of cold water. Just run it through for a few seconds, then put it on a clean plate. Then you set out this plate in the sunlight and just let it air dry. It'll dry depending on the climate and the region in the world where you're in, but this method is so simple, it doesn't need doesn't require anything and it's great. So crystal clearing is very important whenever you buy a new crystal. However, after using crystal for a few months like this one, you should also clear it in one of these ways. And this kind of just expels any of the old energies that are stuck with it and it gives it a fresh start, kind of lets you, lets you use its full potential. But why should you clear a crystal anyways? Well. The main reason of it is because crystals take in energy just as much as they take put out energy. So if somebody touches this and they have like negative thoughts, then the crystal is going to take it upon itself and kind of expel them to the person wearing it in the future. That's why when you're buying it, like you're buying it from a shop and someone touches it, you should always wash it, wash it, wash it. And never like just give your crystal to someone else to just to touch or to see. No, just if you're showing it to someone, just show it in midair, okay? Really important things. I think this is um, about it for today's video. I hope that you've enjoyed this crystal talk. Bim bim.